In this quick tip, I will explain you how to make a selection at uh, exact uh, aspect ratio, uh, like for example, one by one, two by one, three by two, and so on, or how to make selection uh, at exact dimensions, like uh, 2000 pixels by 1200 pixels or uh, 200 by 200 pixels. Uh, so uh, I found uh, this uh, option very useful when I want to cut out uh, pieces from a uh, photo or when I want to uh, crop image but without uh, to scale it, it without to uh, make any interpolation. Uh, here I have image uh, which is uh, from Adobe Stock and it's 2100 pixels by uh, 1362 pixels. And let's say I want to crop only 2000 pixels in width and uh, in height I want uh, uh, 1200 pixels or 1200 pixels and I don't want to interpolate pixels I want just to cut uh, existing pixels and here is how to make uh, this selection uh, you go to a rectangular marquee, marquee tool and then look uh, for options uh, in the options bar uh, for style it's now set for normal uh, what means you can just drag and make selection uh, now if you expand this uh, list you will see uh, fixed uh, fixed uh, ratio uh, when uh, select uh, when you select this option you will see uh, some numbers in width and height and now you can uh, retype uh, these numbers to change a ratio. For example, uh, three by two. And now this is a, a ratio which will be constrained uh, when you drag your selection. And now I will drag my selection and it's three by two ratio. And uh, now, for example, I can crop uh, this image to uh, three by two uh, aspect uh, ratio. Can use uh, uh, cut, copy, or I can go to image crop. And to crop image, uh, as we can do with uh, with a crop tool. So let me uh, go back to show you another uh, option which is fixed size and when you select uh, this option you also have uh, ability to type uh, number of pixels, inches, millimeters or whatever else uh, you want, whatever uh, other uh, measurement option support uh, Photoshop and you can check uh, which measurement uh, unit support uh, Photoshop by uh, right clicking on uh, ruler so you can type pixels inches centimeters millimeters points picas or percents uh, I will go with pixels and here I will type with uh, I will type 2000 pixels by 1200 pixels and now it's enough just to click anywhere and selection in width 2000 pixels and in height 100 uh, 1200 pixels will be created now I can move this selection anywhere to select portion which I want and uh, as uh, previously explained to cut copy or to go to image crop 
and to crop to these uh, spe specific uh, dimensions. So uh, this is uh, uh, my first uh, suggestion when to use uh, selection to specific uh, size or uh, ratio. And another uh, situation when I'm using a lot uh, this uh, selection to fixed uh, size is when uh, recording actions. Uh, let's say that you want to cut out uh, separate uh, pieces on separate layers from this or any other image. And uh, it's a very common uh, and convenient to record action, which will do that uh, job for you. Action you need to record only once. It will work uh, at any time. It works uh, very fast and it will do its uh, job perfectly. Uh, so uh, for this uh, certain situation to cut out pieces, I will uh, start new set, for example, cut out. And I want to explain you how to record uh, along the way, how to record uh, this kind of actions. And now I will start recording a new action which is cut out, let's say, 10 by 6 uh, pieces. And I will stop recording for a moment, just to make uh, guides. It's uh, very common to uh, create uh, guides, so you know where exactly to make uh, your selection. I will go to you and new guide uh, layout. I have previously cut uh, this uh, image to uh, 2000 by 1200 pixels. Uh, so I want 200 uh, pixels uh, square uh, pieces and uh, I will remove gutter and type 10 uh, columns. So it's 2000 by 10, it's 200. And I will check rows, remove gutter and type six. So I have uh, created a guide layout where each piece is 200 uh, pixels in width and height. And now I will change uh, uh, selection to fix its size to 200 and uh, 200 uh, pixels. And I will uh, continue uh, recording uh, my action. And it's enough now just to click once and it will make 200 by 200 uh, pixels selection. Since I have guides, it will snap and it will create uh, selection exactly where I want and the next step is uh, control J to cut out uh, piece on separate layer and then I need to select uh, bottommost layer or uh, background layer which is in this case uh, background and I will continue making selections so just to click uh, on second piece, I have selection, I have background uh, selected, control J. And now uh, just to repeat for all remaining, uh, the remaining uh, thing is to repeat uh, this action by selecting bottommost or uh, background layer and by uh, making selection. And it's uh, in this way, when you have fixed size and uh, width and height typed in these fields, it's just one click. You don't have to drag over and over. And with uh, guides on your screen, it, this task uh, start to be easy as pie. So uh, that was my tip on uh, 
how to make a selection on uh, with uh, fixed uh, size or fixed aspect ratio and uh, how to use it, uh, use this uh, option in uh, in particular in common situation that uh, you will have in your work uh, in uh, with uh, adobe photoshop so thanks uh, thanks for watching and uh, cheers <laughs>